good to have you right here on Style 411, your number one fashion program when it comes to fashion in Nigeria. And of course, this is where we celebrate Nigerian icons. Icons with very new table by works. And I'm particularly happy about the guest we have today. It's someone you would like to meet. And I'm sure the ladies will thank me later. But before that, for those of you who might just be joining the show for the very first time, this is Style 411. We take you through the carpet where we'll see what um, people are wearing and, of course, how well they're doing it on the red carpet. And then, of course, we'll go through style gossip. We love to gossip. We do a bit of gossip of how to be a better us. And, of course, times and trends where we'll talk about this timeless, what's trending, and, of course, how to match time and trends together. Do not forget where we do our Fashion Icon Weekly. This is where we celebrate Nigerian icons doing so well. We're just talking too much. Let's take a break. After the break, I'll be back to read out some more. Look at me now. Look at me now. How? Look at me now. How? Look at me now. Yeah. I'm fresh. Welcome back. It's Star 411, and of course, very, 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 very interesting episode today. I decided to use the word very, 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 very because ladies are going to be happy for what we have today. But before that, let's take it one step at a time. Let's go see what's up on the carpet. Let's see who is wearing what and what is wearing who. And when we return, I will be running out who my fashion icon for this week is. But it's bad, no, but it's elevated. Oh, me, call it Ebenet. Oh, but Bella want to suffocate. But the bad, no, and the delicate. All I told me, I'm a party with you. Oh, I told me, I'm a party with you. But the told me, I'm a party with you. Party with you, yes, I'm a party with you. Welcome back. I really don't know how to say this, but my lips are itching to read out what we have today. Trust me. I mean, okay, I'll just say the way it should come. All right. The person we have in the studio is not um, a designer. She's not a clothier. She's not a cloth cobbler. She's not a hairstylist. Maybe a skin therapist, but not a skin therapist. But trust me, she's a makeup artist, and even much more, she is into fitness. Do I hear someone say, aha, yes. So it's time to take your pen and paper. We'll be doing a lot of lecturing this morning on how to get your self back, be confident, that flat tummy you've been looking for. You know what I'm talking about? That weight you want to lose? We'll be dealing with it right here on this segment. But who is she? She is Ono Shioze Udujie, and um, um, she's the CEO of Shioze's Meal Plan and Allure by Shioze. Those of you who have been on IG, you know who I'm talking about. She is from Osako, West Auchi in Edo State, and of course studied animal science under the agriculture um, faculty from University of Benin. But hey, she thought to herself, I don't want to do this animal thing. I think I have more for human than animals. And this lady is right here to knock off our feet. The way we do it, We'll take a break. Now after the break, you get to meet a fashion icon weekly. Welcome back. It's Star 401. Okay, with the Star 401 and the plug, let's welcome Anna Shilsey. Thank you so much. 
you so much. It's Thank so good you. to have you. Yeah. It feels good oh. to be here too. Okay, so I look at you and I'm like, whoa, this is a mother of two. Yeah. And I feel like I'm a mother of five already. <laughs> With this stature and a whole lot of people, I mean, we hear about liposuction, we hear about uh, people trying to do surgery to keep um, lose weight and okay. But you are all about keeping fit. Yeah. And so I want to ask, okay. is it not difficult? So how do you keep up to this tempo? Um, it's not difficult because um, we, you can actually do this using the normal foods around you. Mm. You know, it's all what my meal plan is all about is about foods around you. These are foods that you even know about. Mm. But it's all about calculating the particular calorie you need for a day mm. in order not to lose weight. Because that's where, in order not to add weight, weight. rather. Because that's where weight gain comes from. Mm. When you eat more than what you need in a day. Mm. So your body automatically stores the rest as glycogen, just stores it as fat, you know. And for women, there are different parts it stores it as. It mm. stores it at. Mm. You know, some people it's their thighs, mm. their arms, it's their everybody, you know, almost every woman is uh, have this problem, the tummy, mm -hmm. you know, and everything. So it's about what my meal plan is all about is about cutting that extra calorie that you don't need mm -hmm. and taking you don't you don't have to eat it in a day. So that's what it's all about. It may be hard at the beginning but at the end of the day it becomes a lifestyle and it's easier. Okay, I like to ask. Yeah. What's the essence of fitness? Is it is it health <coughs> beneficial to anyone? Okay, fitness is, is the benefit of fitness is very is it's a lot. Mm. It's a lot, you know. Health comes first for some people. Mm -hmm. That's you know, we have some people that their doctors have told them, Oh, you need to lose so, so weight to achieve this, or you need to, you know, you don't have to be at this weight, you know, for your health but then for some people it might just be a feel good thing. Mm. You know, they may not be confident about how they look. Mm. You know, they want to f feel better. Mm. You know, some people, it's, it's like that for them. Then we have some other people that is, you know, fertility problems. You know, it's, mm. it's a lot. So the benefit for fitness, it's actually bigger than what some people at a glance may see. Or maybe you feel that this person is, or you feel you're too big or you mm. want to be smaller. For, some, for most women, especially women um, over 30 is way bigger than that mm. for me it started as oh what i want to look like mm. but after a while i noticed it is way way in fact the benefit it's so the the, the health benefit supersedes the mm. appearance benefit or mm. whatever you want to feel like or you look like it's a whole lot so fitness cannot be overemphasized. it's 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 bigger than what everybody even think okay now for instance i have maybe there's a lady who's who's uh, added extra pounds and wants okay. to be like you and mm -hmm. there's this thing we're here mm -hmm. i've got big bones and they just feel with big bones you can't be slim so if you're a size 18 there's no way you can go to a size 8. Okay. is there anything like big bones yeah I, let me address that there's actually something like big bones okay but it has nothing to do with you not being able to lose weight okay there are actually some people that their bone de density you can actually measure that from i think there's a way they measure mm. from checking the wrist their bone density is actually a bit uh, bigger than what normally mm. but it has nothing to do with if you can lose weight or not. or not so being big boned or normal you can everybody can lose weight mm. you know weight loss as a law mm. you take in lesser than what you need in a day. So if you're taking lesser than excess that you need in a day, day. you would definitely lose, lose weight. weight. You would definitely, it's a law. You take in, you lose weight. You know, so my meal plan does uh, focuses on creating a calorie deficit, mm. meaning the calorie you're taking in is lesser than the calorie you are burning. So you're burning more than what you're taking in. So at the end of the week or the end of the day, you are, you know, you're getting there, you're losing that weight. So over a period of time and it is never instant mm. i used to tell women if you see any weight loss solution that they oh you will lose so so, so in such a short period you run away from them because it, it is, could be detrimental yes because weight loss you didn't accumulate it overnight why mm. do you want to get rid of it overnight mm. so it is never instant it is a process mm. and even if you find out it is instant and it happens trust me you're going to pile that, that weight back Mm. because a lifestyle change didn't happen mm. so to maintain that weight you lost 
there should be a new life. Mm. There should be a new, a new, a, a change. Mm. So even if you come on the meal plan and you didn't learn something, you didn't change your lifestyle. It take. It's just a matter of months. Then you will you be, be back. back. Yes. Oh, I see. Yeah, you will. All right. I'm sure ladies are penning down one or two things because this is what we actually need. A whole lot of us just want to remain 16 at 60. I mean, it's achievable. <laughs> anyway, that's what we have right here. But on this note, let's go to a bit of gossip. Ladies, we like to gossip. Let's go see this. And when we return, of course, we'll still be talking with Ono. Go away. The benefits of drinking water for your skin. Drinking an adequate amount of water daily is important for overall good health because water aids in digestion, circulation, absorption, and even excretion. But what about drinking large amounts of water for proper skin health? Claims have been made that drinking water gives you a radiant, healthy, younger looking complexion, while others say it has no effect on skin's appearance whatsoever. The fact is that the skin is an organ. And just like any other part of the body, your skin is made up of cells. And skin cells, like any other cell in the body, are made up of water. Without water, the organs would certainly not function properly or at their best. If your skin is not getting a sufficient amount of water, the lack of hydration will present itself by turning your skin dry, tight and flaky. Dry skin has less resilience and is more prone to wrinkling. As water is lost in large quantities every day, you need to replace it somehow. The unfortunate truth about drinking water and skin is that water will reach all the other organs before it reaches the skin. So, it's important to apply water to our skin and keep it there. This will not only show a visible difference in hydration, but it can prevent wrinkles as well. Welcome back, it's Style 411, and of course, this is a place where you want to talk about looking good and, of course, being good. Okay, I like the fact that you're talking about fitness and its benefit, yeah. uh, but you know, there's just this idea, I don't know, a lot of people do think that too much of everything is not good, and they say um, everything has a side effect for okay. fitness. Okay. Is there anything like side effect, maybe much later in life? There is no side effect for fitness. Cool. There is no side effect. If you go the natural way, you eat right, you create a calorie deficit, you work out or you get active. By the, it, in fact, there's only plus advantages. There's no disadvantages. Of fitness. Of fitness. Okay, now, is there any age barrier? Like, for those who has never done body fitness before, who has okay. never had a reason to exercise, okay. and maybe they're in their late 30s, 40s, 50s, or 60s. Okay. Is there actually an age where you feel you are too old to go into fitness? No. There is not use it is never too late to start i see yeah i have some colleagues in the gym i i work out with i have a particular one she's over 50 but she looks like me impressive there is never a, any age to start it is never too late in fact mm. just start and you start seeing the benefits it is better when you start way earlier mm -hmm. that way your body is used to everything yeah it's not new it's it's you're not learning in your old age but if you didn't start earlier it's fine you can always start at any time there is no age barrier let's talk about tummy fat now i mean that's okay. a major concern <laughs> every lady wants to burn that tummy fat and if they can't burn it they just don't like suction okay i mean okay so let's talk about tummy fat okay what are the um maybe things to do okay and maybe like a personal aid to to, to help you burn t tummy fat okay i usually tell my clients that when it comes to tummy fat or when it comes to fat generally your diet matters and shows you lose weight mm. while your workouts as if you're a gym freak we dictate where the weight loss will come from mm. but your diet is key when we're talking about tummy fat Mm. You cannot put in junk or put in processed foods mm. and you expect your tummy to be all, you know, perfect, flat and everything. Mm. So diet is key. If you, you cannot work out a bad diet, mm. meaning no matter how much you work out, mm -hmm. like I mean, I'm six days in the gym, I'm, I'm there, but my diet is still tight. Mm. No matter how much you work out, you cannot 
work out a bad diet one wrong breakfast can mm. ruin three hours in the gym mm. yeah so it cannot be overemphasized when we're talking about tummy fat that one is strictly diet mm. quote me anywhere it's your diet you know when you go to the gym for example you have some women that have had children and they have maybe dicey recti mm. there are some workouts they cannot do or you mm. see some women that have been through c-section mm. there are some workouts they cannot do immediately mm. those kind of person is the diet they will use to tackle and i mm. i can say for one before i started because i have i have had two children mm -hmm. before i started um, working out properly on my tummy my tummy was already in mm. due to my diet Oh, okay. Yes, so before I started doing the abs and doing mm. weight training or anything, my tummy was already in. Mm. I just had to frame it up in mm. the gym. So for tummy fats, it's, let's, let's not get deceived. Okay. It is the diet. I like the fact that she said, let's not get deceived. Like, hey, do not be deceived. She is totally taken with two children, so <laughs> your eyes should be out of her. <laughs> okay, so I like us talk about shoes as male. Now, I mean, you yeah. were one personality on IG that people... Yeah come to see your result and yeah. I see you do 92 kg yeah. and then now 84 <laughs> kg and you're yeah. like what's going on here you know everybody wants quick reaction yeah okay so if we are sure that this has no side effect okay. and we're also sure that at the end of the day that this is what is going to fetch me now mm -hmm. how often would you suggest that we visit the, the, the gym and when you talk about diet is this something one has to do for the rest of his or her life okay or, I like that you know? and when we talk about diet I like to emphasize that don't start a diet that you know you cannot sustain. sustain. Okay. If you know this is something you cannot be for in the next six months and be okay, don't start it. Mm. You know, my meal plan, it consists of everyday fresh whole meals. Mm. The only thing or the big difference is I replaced all processed foods with ready-to-cook meals, mm. raw, natural foods. Mm. And I have counted the calories for your statistics, for your BMI. Mm. Meaning when I get a client, I get your statistics, I calculate your cal your, the daily calorie need you need mm. to lose weight. There's calorie need to maintain. Mm. I am on that, yes. Okay. You know them, but when I get a bigger client that wants to lose weight, I will do calorie to lose weight, weight. Okay. now when i get that figure i will spread these meals across mm. breakfast lunch dinner and snacks mm. for to meet that calorie number okay i usually leave like a hundred calorie gap just in case for the reason of difference in mm. variety and preparation of the meals because mm. most all my clients are online i'm not there mm. i give recipes and everything so i usually but i don't tell my clients though but now they know mm. so i leave like a hundred you know calorie space so that is what it's all about so it is something that even after you're done with honor you're done with me mm. you can maintain, maintain it maintain yeah you can maintain this diet mm. so it's it, if it's something that you cannot maintain you cannot sustain i see a lot of, i get a lot of clients that after doing i don't want to call names mm. of um, um diets but after doing that diet they come back to me and be like they lost all this weight yes and in three months they gathered it back mm. because a new lifestyle was not formed oh, i usually tell my clients after a week just a week with me a new habit is picked up because mm. i educate them aside me giving them oh this meal this is what you take mm. and everything i tell them what i'm doing mm. You know, I don't hold that information because that is what will make them keep to the plan while I'm not there. Yes. So they know, oh, this is so, so calorie, or this is, oh, if I eat this and this. So they stay away. Mm. It's as bad as my clients, they count their nuts now. Mm. Is that because we have some food that are very healthy, but are calorie dense. Mm. So it doesn't mean because they are healthy, you now go ahead and, and eat, eat a eat lot. Them. Yeah. So when you get portion control, that is what they're talking about, mm. about you portion control even healthy meals mm. you know we can call names so if the diet is not sustainable like that if it is not teaching you something new mm. if it's not creating a new style habit of eating in you then i don't think you should go ahead with it wow i'm sure a lot of us has got one or two things on how to become a better us okay it's time to go see what's up on times and trends let's go see what's trending and what's timeless and we'll be back to wrap up with oh no going away The cost
color nude is definitely gaining ground in fashion. Some say it is the new black. The nude color could be reflected in all forms of fashion from makeup, the eyes and the lips, to dresses and the most common in shoes and bags. What color is exactly nude? Some say it is neutral hues, pad back shades, champagne sand hue. The online color finder for Pantone, the company that largely sets color formula standards for fashion and home goods manufacturing says it's light beige. But the question is, to whom is all these colors truly nude? Arguments going on in the fashion world say they're referring to these colors as nude is racist in nature because it doesn't blend with the skin tones of the colored race. The color brown is referred to as brown. For example, Michelle Obama caused a stare with her frocks when she chose a floor-length gown in a lovely shade to meet the Indian Prime Minister last November. The dress was described by its designer Nahim Han as a sterling silver sequin abstract floral nude strapless gown. Associated Press said it was flesh-colored the color of Obama's skin notwithstanding. Now, Associated Press appears to have revised that description to Champagne, an act that has triggered a lot of conversations. But if the color nude will be justifiably used, it should be colors that blend with the skin of the wearer. Because these colors of nude on the skin of a black is reviewed as a color rather than neutral. So to you, what is nude? Welcome back, it's the Style Formal One. In case you're wondering what it is, this is a place where we take you across the fashion industry and of course take you um, across where we want you to be a better you within and outside. And of course, we've been talking to a fitness professional here in the studio. Okay, before we leave, because I know clients will be itching to want to know more and of course yeah. um, get more of it. Let's get your social media handle yeah. and of course maybe a word or two of advice. Okay, so for on Instagram my uh, fitness page is at Treasures Meal Plan mm -hmm. on Instagram. You know that's you can always reach me through on Facebook. It's also facebook.com slash Shoes meal plan. Mm. You know, I attend to um, clients there on any of the handle. Even if you get to my Instagram page, there's even a contact number that you can actually yeah call or send a message or send an email. And I attend. I have staffs that you know respond to that almost immediately. Okay. And we are willing to cater to uh, my my. The goal is to help as much women mm. as I can. So you're just struggling to women, no men. I do a, a little man, but it's strictly, strictly women. women, yes. Because we matter. We yeah, matter. because if you do a man, uh, if, I, if I get a male client, it's still a woman that will prepare the meals, meals. most okay. of the time. Yeah. Although I have some male that cook their meals, but most of the time, with ex from experience, when I get a meal, I have to get his wife too. To be involved. Yes, yeah, so it's I strictly see. women. Yeah. Okay, in case you're wondering what she is meal is thought about, it's written right now on the screen. Grab it and of course this is our IG page. That is where you can meet. Yeah. Ask all the questions yeah. you can ask. Drill her and be sure that you'll be satisfied <laughs> and satisfied you. as well. Thank yes. you so much. Thank it's been nice so. talking to you. Yeah, it's been nice. I hope you. we'll have you sometime soon. I, I'm looking forward to that. Yes, okay. I would want to. Okay. <laughs> we did mention that she also has a side of her, which is also the makeup side. And Leo yeah. Shiozay, she does makeup and of course she's just an all around beauty person. All you just have to do is visit the page and you get more information. Mm -hmm. Remember, we just said that this is the place where we'll give you information of how to be a better you. And of course, we'll celebrate Nigerian icons. And that's what we've just done. We'll do this same time again next week. But once again, thank you so thank much. Thank you so much for having me. And of course, to you out there, thank you for sticking around. I do love you to have a splendid evening. I'm Uche Onyekuji. Bye for now. Thank you.